Hey tennis friends, it's quarterfinals day here at the LA Tennis Open. I'm standing outside the main gates and there are three Americans that have made it into the quarterfinals for the fourth year in a row at the LA Tennis Open. So let's go inside and see what's going on on the grounds. Behind me right now in the public walkway is John Isner who's stretching out getting ready for his match coming up. And for those of you tennis nuts who need to have some tennis artwork on your wall, you can come to the LA84 Foundation's photo booth and they have all sorts of photos of players. Some of them are autographed. They also have some canvases over here. There's one of Pete Sampras. And all the proceeds go to benefit the uh, National Junior Tennis League Foundation. This should be an interesting match between Duty Sela and Sam Query because on the one side you have the Samurai. And on the other side you have a group that really doesn't have a name but they certainly are here to cheer on Duby Sela. One of the main things that I haven't mentioned yet is the shopping that you can do here. Tennis Warehouse has their own tent. Let's go inside and see what they have. Right behind me are the men's and women's long sleeve t-shirts that you can only get here at the LA Tennis Open. This rack right here is from the Michael Chang collection. That's right, Michael Chang has his own line of tennis attire. And then all along the wall and everywhere else, it's mostly Adidas because Adidas is the clothing sponsor for the LA Tennis Open. And they have changing rooms here and everything so you can go in and try everything on to make sure it fits before you go home. And if you're looking for equipment, they have stuff from Wilson, Head, and all the way at the end they have Prince. And one of the great things about coming to something like this is that generally, most of the time, they actually have a rep from these companies there to talk to you about your specifics about your gear. You know, I've had a lot of people ask me, where do they get those giant tennis balls that they use for the player autographs? Well, here at the Tennis Warehouse booth, they have them here. And generally, you don't see this stuff in the big chain stores, only when you come to an event like the LA Tennis Open. Normally, I don't talk about pricing because, in general, everything's usually around the same price. But I gotta let you know, you know, at groundspass.net, we're always looking for the discount and there's no stadium prices here. I've looked at the men's clothes and even the women's clothes and most of this stuff is around 15% off. Even I couldn't resist a bargain. I had to get me my own long sleeve t-shirt from the LA Tennis Open. Farmers Insurance is a presenting sponsor to the LA Tennis Open and right now they're preparing their hot air balloon right behind me. I'm gonna see if I can get lucky enough to get a ride in it. You know, right now I'm still about 100 feet away from this thing and it's filling up my screen. This thing is huge. Well, the wind's a little squirrely right now for the balloon ride, so I'm gonna watch a little bit of tonight's featured match between Tommy Haas and Murat Safin, and if the wind dies down, we'll see if we can give it another try. Since television has pushed the night tennis back a half an hour, I'm gonna need a little something extra to keep me up late. So I'm getting me my own mocha latte. Well, I'm up here with Captain Jeff, and you know, Jeff Farmers offers insurance for auto, home, business, life insurance, and annuities. Is that correct? That is correct. Well, I tell you, we're flying high here, and uh, we're going to see if we can get a shot somewhere over near the tennis stadium. Well, that's the stadium over there in the background. We can't go too much higher because there's a little bit of wind tonight, but Jeff brought me up as high as he possibly could because that's one of the things that farmers will do for you. They'll go the extra distance. Wow, what a ride. I got to tell you, that was a lot of fun. Be sure to go to check out Farmers.com because we always like to support the people that support tennis. That concludes our report for today. So I'll see you next time with more tennis outside the lines.